Been a few hours, but it felt like days Only been days, but it felt like months So after a long day of class and walking around campus and dealing with this Texas heat, I just want to come home and shower. So I first set the vibes and light me a candle just so my house can have this fall smell. I first take off my makeup, which is really nothing. I've just been wearing tinted moisturizer lately, but I use the meniscular water. So I found these drunk elephant dispenser dupes at the Dollar Tree, and that's what I use to pump out my makeup remover. And it just helps it like be very simple and easy to do. And then I just go in and thoroughly clean my face. And as you can see, it was a lot of stuff <laughs> coming out of my face. So I go in with another wipe and just make sure that it's thoroughly clean before I wash my face. Just to be on the safe side because I really am trying to work on my skincare. So I usually use the Equate Facial Cleanser. But today I decided to use the Pacifica Facial Cleansing Gel. And I can actually say I really liked it. But before I go in and wash my face, I'll always use warm to hot water to rub on my face first to open my pores so that when I go in with my face wash it just thoroughly gets in there and gets everything out. I usually use this little machine that I have that just like really rubs into my face but I'm trying to be more gentle with my skin because my skin is very sensitive so I'm just taking the time to really rub everything in my face. Then I use this makeup cleansing wipe that I got from the Dollar Tree and this stuff really helped get everything out of my face. It was so soft and gentle on my skin and I'm definitely going to use this again. I was just trying it out to see if it like was good Good quality so I go ahead and dry my face and make sure you pat your face or your skin anytime you take showers or wash your face and then I use the aquaphor on my lips just to soften them and moisturize them let's get into this shower routine shall we so I go ahead and turn my shower on you already know how that goes and I like my water hot I'm not gonna lie to y'all that's just my personal preference I don't know how people take cold showers but when I get in, I just go ahead and rinse my body off fully before I even try to wash my body. It just helps the soap and everything get onto my body easier. And before I actually get into cleaning my body, I'm going to wash my hair. And I wash my hair first because there's so many oils and so much dirt that builds up in your hair over the day. And I do not want that getting on my body after I cleanse myself. So I go in with the Brio Geo Scalp Revival Charcoal Shampoo. And this stuff right here, y'all, is so, so so good it actually really cleanses my hair it makes my hair and my scalp feel so refreshed and then like y'all when i got out of the shower i'm not gonna lie to y'all my hair was beyond soft but i've been using this anytime i'm like deep washing my hair and this stuff right here just does its job so run to sephora and go get it then i go in with this little comb scalp scrubber that i got from ross it was like four dollars and i just really scrub on my scalp just to make sure i get any dirt and grime gel etc that has built up over the days that I haven't washed my hair and I go ahead and rinse it out with lukewarm water I actually use a different temperature water when I wash my hair because I want to make sure that everything is getting into my hair properly and then I go in with the Monday hair care conditioner this stuff is so good too I also have the shampoo but I just been using my Brio Geo lately but this stuff softens my hair it cleanses my hair correctly and I go in with my tool again and just scrub my scalp and do the same process that I did with the shampoo now on to cleansing my body i use a bar of soap first because this really cleanses your body the proper way and i usually use the dove bar soap but today i'm going to try out this lush bar soap that i was gifted and just to see how it is it smells so good y'all i'm not gonna lie to y'all it smelled really really good I put the name of it on the screen for you guys if you're interested in it, but I just go in and properly cleanse my body with the bar soap. Make sure you got my legs, my feet. Please wash y'all's legs and feet if y'all don't. Like some people, and I know it's not women, but I know some men who do not wash their legs and their feet, which I don't understand why, but... Now I go in with the Dove Sensitive Skin Body Wash because my skin is very sensitive and it reacts badly to a lot of body washes now. Like my skin starts to itch when I get out the shower. So I switched over to this body wash and I can say that I have definitely seen the difference. My skin doesn't itch or react badly. Now for shaving, I go in with the EOS Shea Better 24 Hour Moisturizing Shaving Cream. This stuff smells so good. It does its job. It's very gentle on my skin as well when I shave. So it makes my shaving process that much more easier. And 
yeah all i really had to shave today was my underpits but i did want to show you guys what i use for that and then now it's time to exfoliate and exfoliating is a big 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 factor in my shower routine because of how sensitive my skin is and most of the time if my skin does get any type of itching sensation i exfoliate and it immediately goes away and just really gets into my skin and relieves all that itching i'm using this barbie collection exfoliator that i found at ross and it smells amazing y'all it smells like cherries it smells so so good make sure to exfoliate my whole body because not only does it relieve itching for me it makes my skin beyond soft it just makes it very gentle and it overall gives that feminine touch so i just take my shower head and rinse my whole body off just to make sure i got everything off and i am done with my shower it's just very simple and basic i don't go like the extra mile to do anything extra because of how sensitive my skin is but i just wanted to do a side note of how pretty it was outside of my house when the sun was setting it was just so gorgeous in houston i used the love me some beet sugar along with the studio selection cocoa divine body oil gel to moisturize after the shower and this combo right here does it for me like i just love the way this body oil makes my legs shine it just looks so pretty to me it gives summer and it just makes my skin beyond soft and and I got this from the Dollar General, I believe. It was very cheap. It was like $4. Nothing crazy, but that's one of my go-tos for sure. And then I use the Victoria's Secrets Pastel Sugar Sky for fragrance when I get out the shower. And then onto my skincare, I use the Dr. Dennis Gross Extra Strength Daily Peel Pads because, y'all, my pores are huge. As you can see, I have lines on my face, and that's one of my biggest insecurities. But I'm just learning that I just have to switch up my skincare to be able to work on my lines on my face I was watching Kyra's TikTok and she said that these helped her like skin clear up and just helped her find lines and stuff like that and I can say from doing it four times that I definitely see a difference in my skin and my overall health of my skin I've watched my pores go from huge to smaller so I'm definitely gonna get back on Amazon and order some more you can also get them from Sephora I was just lazy and didn't feel like going up there so I just ordered a pack of five off of Sephora for I believe 15 to 20 dollars it's very affordable so I go in with the first wipe and rub my face till it dries and then I go in with the second wipe and I do the same in the first wipe you can definitely feel it working in your skin as you can see my skin was kind of getting red my skin was definitely tolerating it and it's not an uncomfortable feeling you could just feel it working so on to getting dressed I always go for a two-piece at night it just makes me feel cute at the same time as comfortable and now it's time to get onto my hair I do use a Brio Geo don't despair repair strength and treatment oil along with the uncle funky's leave-in conditioner spray and along with a Lodius curling cream gel I just go in with the treatment repair and rub that into my hair and my scalp my hair is growing so fast I just did my big chop two weeks ago and my hair is already like a millimeter longer I spray some leave-in conditioner in and rub that into my my hair my hair was feeling so soft y'all like i'm telling y'all the brio geo that's gonna get you right so i'll go ahead and style my hair i'm not gonna go into detail on how i style my hair in this video i'll just make that a separate video but i did go ahead and style my hair because i wanted to just go ahead and do it the night before for school because i don't feel like doing it in the morning but this part is so satisfying and that's all i do for my shower routine thank you guys so much for watching make sure you like comment and subscribe follow me on instagram at Ari josephine bye